Jonathan Lee Riches investigates. Going for a nighttime drive. Like Kohlberger. Just gonna go around at night, in the middle of the night, and go for a drive. You know, for no particular reason, just to drive around neighborhoods at night. Nighttime drive. No, actually, I'm going shopping. But Brian Kohlberger, he admitted it in a court document that he was going on a nighttime drive November 12th into the early morning hours of November 13th when these murders happened. Yeah, I was just driving around because that's what I like to do. Um, I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah, I'm just going to drive around and because I enjoy just using my car and driving around. Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Anyway, check this uh, Check this out right here. This is Ann Taylor filing the motion about his nighttime drive. Mr. Koberger has long had a habit of going for drives alone. Often he would go for drives at night. He did so late on November 12th and into November 13th, 2022. Mr. Koberger is not claiming to be at a specific location at a specific time. At this time, there is not a specific witness to say precisely where Mr. Koberger was at each moment of the hours between late night November 12th, 2022 and early morning November 13th, 2022. He was out, driving during the late night and early morning hours of November 12th to 13th, 2022. So Kohlberger driving around at night because that's what he says he does. And he said cross-examination of witnesses will show that's what he does. Um, cast, FBI cast. Yeah, FBI cast is going to say that he was driving around 12 times prior because of pinks. And I think that's what he's going to use as a alibi by saying, well, see, past said I drive around at night because I've done it before. So what makes the 12th into the 13th so different? I have a history of driving around at night. No, how about Brian Koberger has a history of stalking his victims prior 12 times where he's driving around at night looking for prey. How about that? This nighttime alibi of just driving around is one of the dumbest alibis I ever heard of. How about you? Do you just drive around at night like I'm doing? There's people out, raining out. He's just driving around at night, driving through the neighborhoods, right? Because it's just a cool thing to do, right? Must be a... Idaho thing to just drive around neighborhoods. Wow, look at the rain. Yeah, it's always raining at night. I'm just driving because I'm going to run some errands. I don't just drive around at night. You know, driving around at night, that's what he did on the 21st of uh, August. Remember when he got pulled over at about 11.30 and something at night. Wasn't wearing a seatbelt. I'm wearing my seatbelt. But who just drives around in the middle of the night just to drive around? Now, I can understand the daytime, driving around at daytime, you know. Put your top down, put your windows down, just go for a nice drive, breeze, get the air, sightsee. But at night, in the middle of the night, what reasonable person drives around in the middle of the night just to drive around? No. Usually, people drive around in the middle of the night because they're up to no good criminal activity and that's exactly what Brian Kohlberger did preyed on four innocent college students in the middle of the night and he got caught and he doesn't have an alibi and he admits it that he was driving around at night doesn't look good for Kohlberger subscribe to my channel like hit the notification button I'm driving around at night in the rain look whoa it's always raining in Florida. It's always raining in Florida. Stay safe everyone, wear a seatbelt, drive responsibly.
drive responsibly.